episode of Retro Game Challenge 2. This time it's personal. How personal is it? I don't know, we're just kind of shooting aliens. That's the lore. I don't know if alien violence is really all that praiseworthy, you tell me. Oh, thank you for the applause anyway. When last we left off our stream, we had once again dropped ourselves off on the last challenge of the game. Which means we are still off rhythm. I do not appreciate that at all. How am I supposed to properly lay out the VODs? I can't keep everything in a single video. I mean, come on. Things. Hello, Tony. Yeah, my day's been alright. And who's not about to have an alright day? These aliens. Let's take one last listen to this. So our current challenge is just to clear the second stage. Of course, shmups are not particularly known for having long involved stages. And seeing as how this is a attempt at making a balanced game at least, we are probably not looking at a super difficult one, so this probably won't take long. Let's hope we can find something more interesting to do with our time. Arino on right. tomato Yes, yes it is Arino. It's like a precocious little kid showing up that he finally learned how to read. Which, I mean, no shade, that's what I was like. Anyway, since he's so excited, I think I'll let him join in. I want to be able to use my, my thing I named the stream after. Oh, I bet all the enemies are for you. No, you won't, you liar. Look at all those rocks. Cool. Thanks. Right. Set people on fire very quickly and efficiently this way. That's pretty cool. Coverage all the way around us. Actually, I'm actually pretty fond of this combo. Alright, alright, lag, 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 they're gonna get there eventually. I do with a few motherfuckers. Have a look at how quickly they died. Oh, I accidentally doubled up. Means I am now shooting in every direction simultaneously. I mean, this isn't half bad either, I don't. No. Uh oh. No, oh, I tried. Yes, fire, fire, fire. Why are you trying to attack me from the side, you fools? This is the gimmick of the video game. Enemy ace attacker comes up. Now, I'm actually a, a pretty big fan of... Now, not shmup specifically, but more along the lines of that guy didn't last long. Like those sorts of big, a giant enemy battleship is approaching fast messages. It's curious how the, um... I was about to say localization team, but I guess it's more along the lines of fan localization team. Going to uh, manage to thread one of those without actually just directly copying one, which would have been pretty lazy. Eva, uh, thank you for the hydrant. I'm kind of in the middle of something, but okay. All right. Uh, cheers. Don't know if you all heard it, but I just clinked my my water bottle against the microphone. That might have not been a good idea, actually. 
Mm. All right, I know I'm not that entertaining, but that was uncalled for, I don't know. I mean, really. It's deeply hurtful. Anyway, let's get back to shooting. So, Eva, I don't believe you've showed up for any of the previous videos. For the benefit of any newcomers in the audience, whether it's her or otherwise, this is Retro Game Challenge. Now that I have an excuse to explain that again, we don't have to worry about just... Trying to struggle to come up with things to talk about while in the middle of this nonsense of shmupping. And what I've been working the day. For, I've been working during the day a lot, unfortunately, a lot because of sick. I'm sorry, I can't read well. Kind of dodging bullets. Anyway, as I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted by my own inability to focus on anything, this is Retro Game Challenge 2. It is a sequel to Retro Game Challenge. You might have guessed that from the title. It's like retro games, but they're not real retro games. They were just kind of made up. Here comes this colony's boss. Aristolokia. Adi, Aristolokia. I think I got that pretty good, actually. Uh, you, f you don't stand a chance. Start combined firepower. So. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Doctor, have you destroyed the spy cam already? Yes, yes, we It was fantastic. We lost so many points. Ah, <sighs> there we go. Breathing space, breathing space. This is fantastic. to commentate, I'll have you know. <laughs> that was quick, yeah? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Wait, you... You mean I don't know? I I don't get points for things. I don't know. Oh, you son of a bitch! Okay, now that we've actually finished the stage, we split back apart, and we won't get to come back until we can't. I want a laser. Lasers hurt, hurt more. I thought the stream was five today, so I was here earlier than, than planned. Honestly, I don't... I barely ever actually remember what, like, time I have listed on my schedule. I am the sort of person who has to go back and check my own schedule to remind myself what... what I committed myself to earlier. And is that the sort of thing you would lie about? I, mean, I don't know. I, I, I guess I technically wouldn't know, but... Yeah, I don't know why. Not today. Not yesterday. Maybe today. We are moving very... It's pretty consistently at five, I think. I mean, pretty consistently. Sometimes I will... So this game often goes at six. Yeah, I have... I had this idea in my head that this is a smaller side game sort of thing. Between mystery- I don't know, I don't appreciate you copying me. Here, I have some missiles. I have this idea in my head that this game is a sort of minor side title. So, as part of that, I do generally put it later in with expectations that I will you know, not have streams go as quickly. Oh, I don't know, why did you do that? Man, look at how much death is happening right now. Maybe this game is the main title of Hard Plane Detective, I don't know. Eh, maybe. Not really. It was before you became a chat regular, but I did in the past attempt to play an actual, genuine, uh, like, you know, period, Japan-only Famicom adventure game. It 
did not go particularly well. Yeah, these games were laid out less than efficiently. E even after I like got caved to the point where I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna crack a manual. I'm going to play with the like game facts while they're open in front of me. I still found myself like losing entire streams to just generally not knowing what the hell I was doing. Or just not being able to trigger the flags I was looking for. It was in fact that bad, tell me. A uh, funny little detail, this isn't funny at all, but I don't have any other excuse to start talking about it beyond the general need to fill space. The... Wild Pretty. I don't know, she's not- I mean, she's not bad looking, don't get me wrong, but I think you might be overselling it a little. Anyway, as I was saying... Those fusion items, the ones that let us turn into this unstoppable boss-killing monstrosity of a gun. When did you get those is determined by the number of enemies you kill. And the way, the specific way that number is calculated is based off of a rolling title with Remember the game sound audio? If you insist. Alright, there's negative 12 decibels. Is this any better? As I was saying. As I was saying. I think that was the challenge, actually. Okay, great. We did it. Hooray. And we are 17 minutes into stream. God, that did go quickly. Anyway, what I was trying to say... Not that it matters anymore, is that when you get those fusion items is based on a checkpoint system of, you know, enemies killed. So you have to get the specific number, like it's... These are not the actual numbers, this is just something I'm pulling directly out of my arse. Like, seven, um, like, seven enemy... Okay, that's too low, that's not even realistic. Like, 20 enemies, then 40 enemies, after that, then 60 enemies. And the enemies you do kill while you're in fusion mode do count towards those titles. So the real point attack strategies is to deliberately avoid killing enemies while you're out in fusion mode. Because... That keeps you from looping, which means you can just, like, shoot one enemy next time and get it immediately. That sounds like a lot of work, and Adina wouldn't agree to it anyway, so I don't really do that ever. But if you decide to pick this game up for yourself, that's a little piece of advice from me to you. Anyway, Adina would like us to know that we did it in case the massive fan I didn't give it away. Yet. Did it. That's the end of the gun duel challenges. What's the next game? I can't wait. That's the end of that. But the high score challenges have only just begun. Let's play gun duel again when you feel like it. Which means it is in fact time for the next game. Oh. Oh, oh, man, I, I actually didn't realize this was uh, this soon already. I guess we are playing Adino Ace Detective 2 soon. Okay, how do I want to manage this? Yeah, 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 get up, old man. Alright, here's your next challenge. Is it is, is uh, what I'd like to say, but <laughs> you see, uh, uh, I've got to think of a new challenge for you. This this is this is just me trying to draw up my weekly schedules when I'm between games.
I can't get Doc. Yeah, 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 I, I know what you're thinking. But the fact is... There's nothing here. No use crying over spilt milk. I don't have a challenge. But maybe it's not so bad. Maybe. I guess Detective Adina was so successful that I could just follow up very quickly. No, this is a, um... If you'll remember in, like, the first magazine we ever looked through, and I think even in the manual too, this was developed from the first as a two-game, one-game for the price of two title. This is a direct continuation and not a sequel in the sense of the world. Sense of the word, the word. I'm biting my tongue like nobody's business today. Think of it more along the lines of, like... Like, imagine if they released every disc of Final Fantasy VII as a separate game. That's why we're looking at right now. Not to, uh, you know, give Square any ideas. <laughs> anyway, I'll be back soon with the new game challenges. Uh, but don't think for a second you're all done. Just because you cleared all the challenges so far. <laughs> Key man. This is just a short break while I regain my composure. Yeah, that's it. So I will catch my breath. What? No challenges. No challenges. Kind of a letdown. I bought the second part of Ace Detective, too. I don't know, Ace Detective. Act 2 added to games. What a mag for Hanson solving the mystery. Game Fan, August 87, added to magazines. I want to know what happens next in Ace Detective. I know there's no challenges, oh well. I wonder what game I'll challenge next. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, this is weird. And then there was a rather long period of time where not a whole lot happened. Hey, it's me again, losers! I found a new challenge game for you to attempt! This time you'll be playing Trial Toss. Trial Toss, Triodos, Tretos, Trio Terms of Service, I'm not sure. Not only that, it's the first time to try a portable game. I, I, all of these titles, portable games, I mean, they're on a, a portable system. I, I've got it in my hand right now. It's just, it's just two screens, you know? It's tiny, but it has big potential. The size won't affect how hard these challenges will be. <laughs> I've taken this guy on a tour through like five different voices, like villainous accents in the course of this one cutscene. Kinda wacky. This is your first challenge! Line up blocks of the same type. For this challenge, line up the following triominos so they make up a line or row of three or more. And watch them disappear. Keep an eye on the markings so you can match them up. Yeah, that does sound like a detective value in a challenge. Uh, uh, Tome, did you just sleep through the past several minutes of a video? I mean, I don't blame you, I would have done the same thing in your position. I have three or more blocks with the same pattern. It doesn't matter in which mode, you can succeed in any one. Clearing lines of blocks is the basic element of Triotos. So basically that if you can't even remember it, then forget about trying to clear the other challenges. Ta-da! I got a game come mini. 
I got Tritos for it, naturally. Why do you all keep doing that? Honestly, how rude. Tiny. This thing's tiny. Even the cart. It's tiny. Can't believe you can play games on something so small. I was shocked by the size of the floppy, too. Even the hardware's tiny this time. What an invention. I want to give it a Nobel Prize. Oh yeah, I got some good news for ya. Dad got a Gamecom Mini and Triatos from somewhere. He didn't tell me where he got him from. Well, I can't believe Otino's dad is a scalper. Shameful. Truly shameful. But now we've got a pair of devices and carts. In other words, we can play against each other. Let's play Versus later. The latest issue of Game Fan Mag, too, we're all set. To think, I can play games on the go. I'm so glad I was born in these times. I wonder how Adeno's going to react when 9 11 happens. I'm writing my name on my cart so I don't lose it. you give me shade for doing that earlier? Honestly, the hypocrisy. Anyway, that sure was a whole lot of stuff that just happened, wasn't it? We now have three games in our collection that we have not played yet. And we could go down any one of them. What lies in our future is... I don't know, Ace Detective Part 2 for the not Famicom disk system. Triathos, a totally not Tetris game. For the totally not Game Boy, Game Boy. Just Game Boy, it's not the Game Boy Color, that comes later. And, if we pop off to the shop. Come on kids, we're running daylight here. Here in Joico Land, we do have... Rally King Tournament Edition. And for the fastest times in this unreleased tournament-only edition of Rally King. Remember the Drift Boost. I mean, one of these games actually has challenges, but as I've said before, we are totally out of sync and it bothers me slightly. So we could do one or both of those to kill time in order to get ourselves back on track for next episode. Or hell, we could go back and play one of the previous games. That's always an option. We haven't actually beaten any of these, we just cleared a bunch of challenges for them. There's people in chat who weren't here previously. I wouldn't mind showing off for their sake. Wizman. Collect the crystals with magic wands as you race to the top of the tower. Can we do the Triatos game? Would you- would you like to see that? Would you like me to embarrass myself playing Tetris? This man looks cute. I mean, he does. Triatos. Okay, we have one vote for Triatos. There's only two people in chat. Gears. Make by Gears. Gears are the same people who did Robot Ninja Haggle Man. Men. What a group. Okay, when in doubt, read the manual. Triatos. Game manual. Play remotely with friends. From all of us at Gears, we wish to thank you. Thank you for purchasing the game card or try to us by Gears for the game computer mini be sure to read these instructions. Yeah, you know what's up. It's all about threes, making threes disappear. That is Triotos. If you can line up the blocks known as triominos that fall from above to form three of the same type in a line, you have a Triotos. Watch them disappear. It is a never-ending wave of blocks. A whole new type of puzzle game. Alright. Down drops. A for clockwise, B for anticlockwise. I thought it was a match three game first, but Tetris is fun too. It, it... I guess it is a match three game. It's just a match three game made using Tetrominos. 
They gotta, they gotta thread the needle just far enough to avoid copyright infringement, don't you know? My endless mode versus rival mode and versus 2P mode. So you'll have two layers of next. That's more than the actual Game Boy version of the actual Tetris got. Welcome to the future, old man. And everything beyond that is just... Look, you've, you've played a falling block game before. Yet special school scores like... Pluses and L's. Incredible. I think we've got Tetris Battle Royale yet at this time. Yes, the, the Tetris Battle Royale. And only one of you is leaving this room alive. <laughs> Yep, you just, you just get more points for clearing more blocks at once. How to play Triotos, Zenmai. The troll and the Triotos Master, Zenmai. Zenmai, of course, being the baby character from Robot Ninja Hagudaman. Zenmai, how can I get rid of these pesky blocks? Oh, have you watched the demo with the mode select -like screen? It shows many of the cool tricks and techniques you need. I'm sorry I had to subject you to that. I keep losing in versus mode when I send over so many blocks. If your opponent is attacking, you will see arrows on the field. Your attacks just cancel his. Wait for them to disappear, then attack. Yes, deliberately let yourself get sent garbage blocks. That's a good strategy. Are you fresh in yours yet? Alright. That's enough words. Let's plug this bad boy in. Maybe tell me redeemed to hydrate. Thank you. So we might as well tamper with the stream tags while we're here since the old one. Is no longer accurate. And that said, I'm running out of excuses to stall, so here we go. Game computer mini. This isn't a real Game Boy, I can see what's happening when things are moving. Yes, and this time they skip directly to the light. Yep, this is in fact Triatos. Gear, period, gear. Well, like our hater, she's spitting straight facts. Alright, in we go. <laughs> I'm sorry, it just... It always makes me laugh when we see a really basic challenge and they give us the same triumphant swelling music that we get out of... Yeah, something that's actually an accomplishment. Not that I know what being a, having accomplishments is like. Way to go, you cleared the challenge. My neck's kind of sore from peeking over your shoulder. Ah, well... Deal with it. Maybe you just have bad posture, you ever think of that? Man. Gamecom Mini, sweet, you can play games anywhere. You can even game outdoors. I mean, not that you can see the screen through the sun glare, but you know. And we're fighting with Mom over who gets the TV. What a prevention. No, what a revolution! Oh, uh, 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 one, one second, I'm playing Triatos. Oh, come on, just, just one more level. Quiet, you're gonna break my flow here. Oh, for that, uh, 
<laughs> Say I messed up, Kazuyu. It's nice going. This is the only way you can make it up. Clear my next challenge. Place a multi mark block. To beat this challenge, make six or more triomaners disappear at once to make a multi mark block full. Place the multi mark block to finish the challenge. Any mode, six blocks. Now let's hide up with other things to finish this quick. Challenge? Uh, hold, hold on. Pretty fine, Tritosis Endless Mode. Oh. <laughs> no! Sure, I'm low on power. Mom! Mom, bring me batteries! Mom, hurry up! No, I'm. I'm running! <laughs> <sighs> I died. You've been using too many batteries lately. They're coming right out of your allowance. I should have used an adapter at home. It's a... Funny, I don't think we're going to... I don't recall there being any sort of Sega Master System pastiche in this title. So I guess that was the only place they could have done that joke, but man... How much are you playing that you're running down the batteries on an old school Game Boy? I mean, really. Anyway, we haven't looked at either of our mags yet. We should probably do that at some point. I know his voice acting has a lot more motion than a lot of movies out there. And yeah, well, I had to learn to pretend. Because I can't really emote otherwise. I'm actually dead inside anyway. Look at this magazine. Hot portable gaming goes on sale. It's called the Game Computer Mini. The future is now, old man. You can take your favorite games with you on the move with you with four contrast levels of black and white. We can see our games anywhere. No matter where you are, you can enjoy your favorite games. I can't wait to. It's, uh... It's a bit weird that they're putting this foreshadowing after we already got it, you know? Bit just, just, just a, a slightly unusual, that's all I'm saying. Detective Audino strikes back. Escaping police and a secret organization? I don't know, you're the news outlet, you tell me. Don't, don't ask me questions. I don't know any more than you do. The long-awaited sequel is now here. From the first seven mysteries to the mysterious group known as Love and Game. What will become of Audino? You'll have to play to see. The plot is thicker than we thought. Is that so? We got the dirt on the story behind the Kacho's new adventure by rifling through Arisaka's notes that he made during development. Let me see. Spoilers? I don't think so. It was a tough job, but the editors managed to track down the latest of the sequel to Detective Audino. What this means is we were following Mr. Arisaka and he dropped something that we picked up. Hmm. Buildings. New locations, perhaps. The world really expands in the sequel. This feels illegal somehow. Like gaming paparazzi. You know, it, it, it was so tragic when the gaming paparazzi case chased Princess Diana down to ask her what her favorite game was. She dropped a building and they picked it. Yes, they dropped an entire building out of his pocket. What, you mean, you, you mean you've never, like, just put your house in your back pocket to make sure no one breaks in while you're out? You really should, it's a pretty basic crime prevention technique. Now, high school trick, high school, uh, school, high school tricks for gun duel. Yo, Abe here. They called me back to tell you about a secret bonus technique. When you get a group of four to nine enemies like this in the picture, destroy them all to get a sweet bonus of 1,000 to 3,000 points. Courtesy of 30 to 50 feral hogs. Careful, when one dies, the others run. 
When you start attacking, you put them in a thick wall of armor. You want to catch shot? Yeah, uh-huh. I think most weapons can deal with this guy, actually. Destroy the ox when it's merged. What? Why? What did the ox ever do to you? That's what I'd like to know. Right after you defeat the mid-boss of Colony 2, there will be a pair of enemies that merge to form the ox. Destroy them together for a 20,000 point bonus. Destroy the left and right side cores, the enemy will change to the reverse side. He has to get more firepower, but there are many more turrets and things to destroy for score. Yep, when in doubt, shoot people. There's a hidden tomato panel in each colony. Colony 1, if you get the tiles in order, iron, bronze, silver, gold, you get 1 million points. Look for the areas in the pictures. That's pretty zoomed in. I can't say that actually helps me any game. And Star Prince SA is on fire. God, that's another game. So much stuff in this game. I can't believe it. It's a massive, like, scale improvement on the previous game. I can't I can't say I'm actually like upset. Just makes a Planning videos in advance a bit difficult. I think I'm good at that anyway. Can you show me how to hold a controller so it looks like I'm good at games? A controller isn't something to be held. It's an extension of yourself. Maybe you should improve your game. Just looking good isn't cool. From Eno. Okay, you know, you know that, that that message was probably written to you by, like, a three-year-old, right? Honestly. The music industry is looking to put celebrity games on the charts, too. And our letter from the editor. Would you listen to Utokawa, the revolutionary new hardware? Can I talk about the new handheld this month? It was already in this issue, but I want to talk about the portable game console. Is it out yet? But everyone, including me, is waiting impatiently for it. I'll let you know when I find out anything on this super cool new console on the go. Right, and let's get this last one out of the way. Because it contains... Info on the Super Gamecom, which has been delayed, oh no. Tragedy. A researcher's tool becomes a puzzle game. Drop, line up, disappear. Triotos, on sale now. What started as a Czech mathematician's tool turned into an amazing game. Gears took up development and made a brand new puzzle game. Gears gives us a taste of Europe. <laughs> you see, it's it's like how, how Tetris was originally developed in the Soviet Union. It's literally just Tetris. I don't know what more to tell you all. Line of groups of two to start. When you build up a stash, a multi-mark block can make short work of many blocks at once. If you have groups of two already set up, you can get rid of them all, fast. Aim to clear the screen. Start by aiming at six blocks at once. Try to get rid of six or even eight blocks. At once. By lining up groups of two, you can aim for getting eight blocks at once, as in the picture. Line up two groups in one spot and another group nearby. Line up a block like that picture to get four at once. Okay. I do appreciate that they're just telling a strategy because I am not good at thinking like several moves ahead in games like these. If it like a pure turn-based thing and I could have time to sit down and focus, I could do it no problem, but if you're gonna make me just go ahead, I'm gonna start panicking. When you play Vasu's Raibaru mode, if you pause the game and enter any of the three commands on the next page, you can call on your friends from Haggleman to come and aid you from the next dropped block. Alright, up A, down A, up B, down B, left A, right B. 
Get each one once per stage. That's pretty blatant cheating. More importantly, however, the next RPG is on its way. A new entry in the Guardia Quest series. Game Fan has an exclusive scoop. The maker Coelacanth announced their next Guardia Quest title on the Gamecom Mini. It will be called Guardia Quest Saga, and it takes place 100 years after Guardia Quest 2 on the Gamecom. Alright, neither of you, you were here, if I recall, for the Right to Game Challenge 1 playthrough. But the joke here is that we played Gaudia Quest 1 last stream, and it ended with a- not last stream, last game. And it ended on a massive cliffhanger for Gaudia Quest 2. And now that the sequel's out, we don't get to play Gaudia Quest 2. What happened? Did anyone survive? How was the war resolved? I guess we'll just... Never find out. Guardia Quest, illustrations and art. New, three players go for the Guardia Meister. Why can't we play the second? Cause it's not in any of the games. These are the pictures and illustrations from Guardia Quest Saga. Using Guardias, our heroes go after the Guardia Meister. Their adventure is about to begin. The three heroes of Gaudia are together again. We confront the main creator, Mr. Khan. We spoke to the main creator of the Gaudia Quest series and he showed us his newest monster designs and scenarios for our heroes. He says designing for the Gamecom Mini is a whole new challenge he's looking forward to. The new handheld, Gamecom. Mini. How long will they be sold out? No matter where you go, it seems everyone has a mini on them. This has even non-gamers lining up to pick one up. This has led to explosive sales since May 27th. The commercial wasn't kidding. Play Gamecom. Anytime. Anywhere. <coughs> From... No. I got something in my throat. Hold on. Okay, JK, not dead. Man, having them talk about commercials like this just makes me feel like they should have actually put commercials in game. They're going so far out of their way to recreate the experience. You got a friend on the couch making commentary while you play, you're reading magazines, you're talking to friends. I feel like adding commercials probably wouldn't be that much of an extra, extra cost. I mean, the, um, I, I've played, like, non, like, not even retro games that did that occasionally. But enough of that, we have to talk about the SNES. The new console, Super Gamecom. The dream console has been... delayed. The upcoming console with a 16-bit CPU with a Super Game Computer has been pushed back from this fall to next year. This is disappointing, but we will keep you updated on any new developments as we find them. From Eno. All we can do is wait for release. Man, Eno was carrying this entire magazine. No wonder she debuted as a final boss. Check out Gun Duel's death mode. Oh, this ought to be sure fun. And the title is fully shown. Enter. Alright, two quarter circles clockwise starting from down. When you hear the chime, you can start the game in 1P or 2P mode, and no gun units will appear. That sounds horrifying. I kinda wanna try it. The voice of gaming. There are guys in the office with a big band around their arm. What is that? Those are weights for employees in training. Each one weighs 25 kilograms. It's like being at the gym while having the same results. From Fujimoto. Is that, is that, is that what it was? I see. Everybody's training for the next World Martial Arts Tournament. The Adventure Game Boom is here. Adventure Games finished at the first, second, and third starts this month. And the first one is just literally just Columbo. 
And I kind of want to play that game instead. Just want to go and tell people, you know, just, uh, just one more thing, sir. How could you have had an alibi that you were playing on the PS3? PS3 doesn't have any games. Oh, well, that's a very simple detective. I was merely playing on backwards compatibility from the old PlayStation 2 titles. You know I'm quite a fan of retro games, good sir. Oh, well, yeah, I see that. That makes perfect sense, sir. I'm sorry I even brought it up. That was my Columbo. There are many like it, but that one was mine. Anyway, hello. I am a student studying the business as part of school, so they made me chief editor for a day to see how things run. I learned a lot from people here about design, but I was surprised to see people sleeping in their chair. From Ken. Age 9. Oh, Ken. I wonder what you're gonna grow up to do. Maybe he will get into games journalism, but only because he thinks it's a job where you can just get away with sleeping on the job. Honestly, if I thought that, I would have done this. I do not appreciate... I'd like to be able to sleep on the job. I'd like to be able to sleep in general, really. Anyway, try our toes. My current challenge for those of you who don't forget, who don't remember, because we just went through a lot of stuff, was to get six in a row. And in we go. Should be easy, just cover the floor with one singular. Yeah, get those out of the way. He's being very rude right now, let me tell you. And I guess that's, uh, that's something. I... Okay. Alright, fine, I guess that's something. Alright. This really sucks, actually. There we go. Was only five. Okay. What am I even doing? Just put blocks of the same color close together. Clear out eventually. I'm sure this will come as a shock to you, but this is not how I normally play Tetris, but I'm not doing challenge runs, as it were. You get in there. Harder than regular Tetris. I'm not sure it is actually. I might just be kind of an embarrassment. Honestly, this isn't particularly well either. Out of my way. Boom, boom. If 
I can just clear all of these out. generally considered light. I'm kind of... kind of in deep focus mode right now. A few diagonals don't count. I'd make life a lot easier. Yeah, just... just... Get this out of the way. Six trailminos disappear at once. Not like in a line or anything, just make them all go away. Alright, that's that's certainly an opening. to know. I've got a lot of relevant pieces all in the same place at the same time. Can any of them to go off? There we go. It's like more like Puyo Puyo than Tetris. Now, of course, those haven't been separate games in a decent while. Cleared it again. That was amazing, yeah, was it, though? Oh, man, this is bad. Triatas is bad news, dude. There's nothing about it that makes it... addictive. It was first made by a company in Czechoslovakia. By the way, where is Czechoslovakia? You see... It's east of Japan. Why is Tori East? If you consider the Earth's shape, they're both correct. Don't be so vague. Are you a Triatus Pro yet? Are you getting the hang of all the game's techniques? Your challenge this time is... to see if you can pull off a special technique. That's the plan. Here we go. Before my line spark. To win this challenge, get a full horizontal line. I did this already, you big joik. Come on. You were there. You saw it happen. I know you're always watching me. When I'm in the bathroom, it's honestly really awkward. Now oh, this month's game fan. We're all very proud of you. Hey, it's the 90s! Also, that game's finally come to Joyco Land! Joyco Land, where you can experience joy for the first time in your life. You know, Star Princess A. It's a special edition made for game tourneys. My god, these games are multiplying out of control. Triatos was made by Gears. They also made Haggleman. Did you play Haggleman in Joyco Land? I don't know, you were there when I did that too. I think all the Autonos have short term memory loss. I think that the amount of time travel in this game is just making all of their just making them all subject to time paradoxes. I heard there's Haggleman characters in Triotos. Remember the baby's name again? Uh, let's see. Little something. Yeah, yeah, little something. Dance started with the letter Z. 
Hey, name something that starts with Z. What the heck is that? That's too long. And you can't just put two words together to make one. I don't know, how do you think words are made? Anyway, good talk. I'm gonna do this now before we forget. The magazine will still be there when I get back. Don't be so impatient, chat. I said press start, but I pressed A and they accepted it anyway. That's false advertising. I'm going to hydrate right now because we've told them I asked for it. Take a minute. Man, this game is really good at making you feel like you know what you're doing. Whoa. All the blocks disappeared at once. All one of them. That line sparks something else. It erases all the blocks with the same marking. D did you get that? We, we, we've only explained it to you 15 times. That feels good. So satisfying. When I try to do it, I get too greedy. I stack him high until it's Game Overa. I guess greed doesn't pay. Truly, this is the greatest fall a man can undergo. Alright, you're finally to the last Triatus Challenge. Triatus does have a lot of modes. This time, your challenge will be to face off against the CPU. Beat level 3 on versus rival mode. To beat this challenge, play versus rival mode and beat level 3. You check your rival status on the left of the screen. Get lines of 4 or more to attack your rival. Play a level 3 in the versus rival mode. If you do it in another mode, it won't count. When you're facing an opponent, weird blocks sometimes appear. Can you handle playing Tritos while dealing with this? Honestly, probably not. Yeah, my mom took away my GameCom Mini. <clears throat> I didn't get in trouble or nothing. She just got hooked on Tritos. My mom's hogging my GameCom Mini for herself! No! And when I played against her, she crushed me. My mom was like crazy good. Mm, yep. Mm, gaming. Anyway, we haven't spoken in a while. How are you doing? Practicing a lot to prepare for our fight. I won't lose. Prepare to be blown away. I'm sure. So I've heard. Oh, oh. Sorry, I was stacking blocks in my head. Ah uh, yes, the Triotos effect, available now for Nintendo Switch. Gamecom Mini might be- actually no, what, what would the uh... Instead of Famicom, it's Gamecom. Instead of Game Boy, it's Famicom Mi- it's Gamecom Mini. Instead of Sega Master System, it's MS-1000. What would the Switch equivalent in this timeline be? The Nintendo... Flip. Because you flip it between the two modes. That's my answer. But you should never take it to school. Anyway, good talk. Let's check this shit. No, we have a magazine. I almost forgot. It's not gonna leave, but it will disappear into the pile, just like all my unread books. 
More info on Guardia Quest. I want to know more info about Guardia Quest. A new genre of falling items that started to revolutionize puzzle games with Triotos. The creator, Joseph Kronos, was in town for a seminar and stopped to meet us and play a few rounds. Joseph Kronos speaks. I'm so happy you enjoyed playing my game. I don't know what Czech accents sound like. Are they just Russian accents? At first, it was just a mapping tool, but when I thought about how to make it a fun exercise for my son, it suddenly hit me. And the result is the popular game on the Gamecom Mini. It's like a dream. Once the guys from Gears came to speak with me, I knew it would be a big hit. My work became this wonderful game. This really made me happy. The game, the Japanese designers had real passion, and their ideas turned my original work and suggestions into a nice, simple look. And a, to a beautiful masterpiece. Look at it. I think I'll celebrate with a soba lunch. And Dr. Kronos is 46, I see. It's not even a real age. You're lying. Hello, this is Kibe from Gears. By now, everyone knows about the three Hagelman characters, but I wanted to try out the hugely popular versus battle mode, where you can match your wits against other live players. Battle real human opponents. I asked a guy over the bus stop for a quick battle. I started by sending over as many blocks as fast as I could, and then he said, I like taking your blocks and building a 12 block combo. Thanks. All right. Stairs. Ugh. I know a lot of these tricks already, I just never think to set them up while I'm actually in the heat of battle. There's so many good players. I give up. Not to be deterred, I challenged a student on the bus. I did not think a local boy could be this good, but as I lost, he explained. He exclaimed. I love the rush I get when I set up line sparks and clear the field. It's so exciting to battle other people. Alright, continue code for versus rivals mode is probably the same as yep, up up. I know this is different. From the menu screen, enter up up, down down, BB, down down. You can change the level. Coming next year, the game computer Mini Color. It's called Mini Color because it only has a, a, a little bit of color. Listen up. The upcoming Gamecom Mini now has an official release date. It hasn't even been a year since the original Mini, but they want to hurry and bring us a full color experience. Best of all, it can also play all the Gamecom Mini games. Enjoy buying a slight iteration on the same product you just bought, losers. More importantly, new hot news on Guardia Quest Saga. Mr. Khan reports it will be for the Mini Color. Mr. Khan from Sealacanth announced that due to the large size of the game, Guardia Quest Saga will be released for the GameCom Mini, and not the GameCom Mini. Mini, mini color, mini. You, you all can read, you all know what's happening. He apologized for the sudden change, but says it was for the best. Sad news? Happy news? We report and you decide. But we do have some good news for you. The Super Game Com comes out October 21st. A game console with twice the power, better sound, and GFX has a release date. In addition to the D-pad, it has six buttons for enhanced game capabilities. Sounds like a lot of buttons. Guess we'd better work out. It can also rotate and stretch game images. The people are forced by the Minicom color, that's awful. I mean, you could make that argument about literally any new console. Like, is it a tragedy that I can't play Splatoon on my- that I can't play Splatoon 3 on my Wii U? Is it a tragedy that I can't play Splatoon 3 on my NES? I mean, yes, objectively. I'd like a job with a good and steady income. What do you recommend? Hmm. Farming is always a stable career. You set your own schedule and harvest your own profits for the boot. Just watch out for animal revolts. 
You might find yourself looking from pigs to people and from people to pigs and not being able to see the difference. But yeah, no, actually farming is a terrible way to live. Why do you think all those people who won't shut up about Stardew Valley still play video games instead of going out and actually doing farming in real life, huh? Huh? Anyway, Tritos is in number one. I'm so surprised. Boy, I am Inuko Max Fool. I have something to tell you. I passed the pro wrestling entrance exam. So now the wrestler editor is born. Or so I'd like to say, if I weren't leaving my editorial position. So come on and give your support to my successor. Whoever that is. That's certainly one way to leave. Doctor, my grandpa doesn't own a farm. I can't live my Stardew Valley dreams. Well, that's kind of like a personal failing on your end. Speaking of personal feelings, I have to play more Triotos. Huh? That's weird. It won't turn on. Whenever this happens... hey It needs a karate chop once in a while, or else it gets lazy. I mean, it worked. You can't argue with results. Chad, are you ready for some gaming? Professor's Rival, level one. Probably going to just completely suicide before we even get in. Boing, boing. There we go. That's a good score. Best's done for. Yeah, that didn't count for anything. But hey, we won anyway. You win. Perfecto. Holy cutscenes. So is this is this our rival? Am I fighting a giant block? And I suppose that would be theoretically appropriate. Thematically appropriate, as it were. Maybe even both at once. You get out of my way. There we go with that. Hey, we did a combo. I'm so cool. Perfect. This is incredible. Once you get in the good rhythm, it's actually not that difficult. Hard part is getting in the rhythm in the first place. Wham. Bam. Thank you, ma'am. Thing is, I just don't play puzzle games often enough to uh, actually ever get in that headspace.
Which might be surprising, coming from me. And I prefer a bit less abstract sorts of puzzles. I mean, that guy. He's got beady little eyes like a criminal. I guess that works on Chris. Wink. Mucho job. Pew. Pew. Yes. Man, this guy's getting shit wrecked. It's kind of embarrassing, my good man. Ah, oh, crap. Wait, no, what? Okay, so I'm not ashamed to admit it really bothers me that I can't actually see what in God's name he's doing. Like, how do I know that was even a real move? That's not a thing he did. That field is not being modeled anywhere in the game. Anyway, I know we do have... I know we do have the continue code now, but I would like to... able to get in. What am I trying to say? I'd like to at least be able to pretend I got that legit. Yeah, let's do anything for you. are actually worth. There we go. Ah, take that. You fool. You foolish child. for anything. That's probably gonna leave a mark. I think I'm gonna do my ultimate finishing move. See, what a disappointment. Alright, who's next? Yeah, that's how I feel too, but we gotta get through this. And I'd appreciate it any more than you do. Maybe you just curl up and die to end quickly. That is so many black blocks.
感じじゃん There's a two hit combo. And that just kind of went down on its own. I had nothing to do with that. It looks like I'm building up for something, but I'm actually just kind of putting blocks down randomly. I mean, real saving grace here is that my opponent is even worse than I am. Okay. Somehow we were able to pull it off. Oh, Zen Mai, why have you completely taken over? Block breaking duty. I thought it was my job. Alright. Who is my rival, actually? I know nothing about this man. I'm just kind of taking it on faith that he even exists. something, you're not dumb enough to be dying this early on. Yep, there he goes. Extremely bad, actually. Thank you for observing that, you know? Now if I can just take that one square, go away, please, and thank you. Alright, dude, drop combos not count for anything. It's more about making it. Specifically, block piles. Right, that's the only square I can make that into. Okay, thank you. I'd like to comment on what's happening here, but I uh, can't see half the board, which seems... I feel like an oversight, for being honest. There we go, okay. And then he just kind of stopped being alive. We won. Hooray! We did it. Congratulations. Is the rival tough? I always lose. I practice all the time because I need more training, but... 
I've got a bed. I've been stacking trail my nose in my dreams. So this block here, and then erase the next block. It's all I've been dreaming about. And even in dream world, I get Gameo Vera. I should at least do well in my dreams. But never mind that, Gaudia Quest Saga just came out. It is the year 0091 of the game era. Alright, Game Master Ajna is going to come in to for our next challenge like usual. Hehehe, <laughs> yuck it up, yuck it up, why don't ya? Wanna have the next challenge? Huh? Do ya? Do ya? Your next challenge will be for Gaudia Quest Saga. It's the third installment in the popular RPG series. They delayed its release as I was preparing the challenges. So I was afraid I'd have nothing for you to attempt. I know you've been waiting, so heads up. It's challenge time! Guardia Quest Saga Challenge 1. Head for Twilight Town. To beat this challenge, I want you to find Ch Twilight Town on the world map. When you arrive, save your game with the journal to finish. Set your sights on Twilight Town. Whatever it is, play the game, start to front, then you're bonkers! Yeah, whatever. Here, got an issue of game fan. <laughs> oh god, the Nia virus is spreading. I know, I know. You don't have to say it. I know what you're thinking. You've been waiting for this moment for ages, yeah? That's right. This room's been renovated. Aren't you impressed? Another you know change we got. We got a new TV too. Ah, so that's what you're after. Yep, I bought it. The long-awaited Guardia Quest Saga is finally here at last. It's been released today. I've been waiting for this. Guardia Quest Saga added to games. Guardia Quest One and Two totally rocked, so I have high hopes for this one. It's for Gamecom Mini Color. So it's got color, too. That's impressive now, because of the progress of time. It's like walking around with a game com. Let's play it! Yeah, about that. We're actually not going to be playing Gaudi Quest Saga this game, this episode, and we're also not going to be reading that new magazine. Because... Gaudi Quest is in fact an RPG. And RPGs are extremely long. And extremely involved. So I would like to divide our videos up to keep them all separated. That means that if we want to keep stream normal length, we've got about half an hour to kill. There's two new games at the shop we haven't played yet. Plus, we could always go back and do some score attacks or progress in games we're finished. Challenges for, but haven't actually beaten yet. See, so the games we haven't played yet are Rally King Tournament Edition and Star Prince Tournament Edition. So, a top down racing game and a shmup that's different than the other shmup. We also go back and play some Wizman, do some platforming. What games do we have? I forget. I don't forget all of them, but I forgot enough of them. Let's see, titles we have yet to finish are... Wizman, an arcade game. Yes. A Kung Fu Pastiche. Platformer. Detective Arino. Gun Duel. And we could play more Triatos. Wizman seems cute. I have one vote for Wizman, I have one vote for Wizman. Going once, going twice, going three times, and... sold. And now my... Oh, I'm so annoying. We're at a good part, too. 
Let's hope and play. Boink. <laughs> this was the first game in the collection, so naturally it's pretty basic. That was weird. So we have these crystals. We have these wands. We collect wands. They let us collect crystals of the same color. You see how this one in front of me is shining? If we get the shiny ones in order, we get more points. We can also use our attacks to shoot ghosts in the back. These gold rods are special. We can only unlock them by doing secret challenges that are different on a per stage basis. And they let us collect wands of both colors. It looks simple now, but it's only gonna get weirder. For example, we can, we can also ring this bell to get some monies. It, it, it sounds complicated, but it's extremely easy to actually understand when you're actually playing it. Like, imagine trying to explain Pac-Man to someone who's never heard of it before. That's a bit what it's like. Good god, it's a massacre. Gold Wand. I believe they mentioned something in Game Fan about there being a ranking system at the end. Depending on... Please stop yelling at me. Depending on how many gold ones you get, but that's weird. This one over here is sparkling more intermittently. I believe that's something of consequence. I don't particularly think cold water, if we're being honest. Anyway, this guy had dropped the key. Red, blue, red, blue, I don't remember why we're doing this, but it's probably of some benefit. The next sparkly one is... that one. Enemies are immune to the same color wand, that's also an aspect. Right, that was it. Sparkly ones are floor scamps. Uh, you're not all that helpful. Shpoink. You know what is helpful? Money. I think we got a bit less because we, uh, weren't topped out. Let's get out of my way. Thank you. And then where was I? Hey, buddy, you're blocking the road! If you a ridiculous amount of money, there's no way you can't get all of it. I mean, hmm. Anyway, that guy's on fire now. This wand is so powerful, you can even set fire on fire. So, around we go. Pick up the pace, buddy! You're blocking the road, asshole! Collecting more than one wand of the same color lets you have more than one projectile on screen at the same time and ups your speed. mechanic with the requirements changing every stage is specifically meant to be a prestige of Tower of Draga. 
One of those old arcade games that no Westerner has ever heard of, but super popular and influential in Japan. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Snatch all these up. Gotta learn ya. Back, back you devil. And because we had a key, we could open that chest you saw for all of a fraction of a second. Which was worth points. You know what else is worth points? This shiny object. Whole hundred points. Oh, you buddy, you just got roasted. The requirements for getting cold wands are deliberately obtuse and unhinted at, in keeping with the general style of arcade games. But anyway, we can skip this point tally. But I'm not going to. Let's let the noises wash over you. Thank you for the hydrate redeem. I wasn't even going that way, he just wanted to interfere. What a dick. Alright, I don't know what I did to get that, but I'm glad I had it. These don't die in one hit. Yeah, where, 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 where are you going? Get back here. Oh god, he's stuck to the outside wall. They're, they're doing loops around the entire setting. Hey, you. Shut your mouth and look at my rod. are dead. Alright, let's ring in the new points. Scarper, 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 Scarper! 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 I got all. It's fine, chat. No need to freak out so much. I should play this very carefully. I mean... Yes. I do appreciate a good chance to take a shot at a bad guy. Don't get me wrong, but okay. There. Perish. A lot of you. Don't you have mercy? Don't you have iframes in the middle of my playthrough? That'll learn ya. Boink, 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 boink. Boink. He's not coming this way. Alright. That's the stage. Let's get out of here. Alright, who's next? That had the potential to go very poorly, but it didn't. Go away. No one here appreciates your presence. I pressed the button. Give me this. Burn. Three wands. Now we 
do have to take a loop here around the outside. I will reiterate, I do not know what I am doing to get these. The requirements are different for every stage. To be frank, none of them make any sense. Was it going around this way? Anything to do with it? Clear a path, my child. Then we left. We have a key, we have four lives. Things are doing pretty, okay? Stage loops around. Which which one am I looking for? I think I dropped a bell. That's something. I think I got them out of order. They shouldn't have switched off yet. Fine, you win. Please do be so kind as to perish. Let's put these guys on ice. Zhubump. Zhubump. Stop yelling at me. I have places to go. Da -da oh crap, it's a Dragon. How to learn ya. Oh god, there's no way I can get to it without, um... Hold on. I am still okay. Doesn't count if we don't collect it, and we can't collect it, because it's the wrong color. Go away. Back up here. I like how Adino sometimes just makes sound effects. Just with his mouth and such. A dick. Be on fire. There. That'll earn ya. I don't like the way you're looking at me. Stop pulling the drag. He keeps trying to set me on fire. What am I supposed to do? Completely evaporate that guy. There is exactly one left. Okay. Okay, do you all wanna do you all wanna get out of my way now? There we go. I am out of there. -da -da. That's a lot of gems. You know, eventually there must come a time when you wonder, like, why doesn't Wizman just cut his losses and leave while he still can? How much wealth does one man need? Of course, we're not actually questing for wealth, so I suppose it doesn't matter. What are we questing for? Hold on. I don't remember. In the ancient city of Avalon, the half-man, half-wizard. Wizard is a speech now, apparently. Weasel searches for the same lost treasure as his father, the Arthurian Stone. There we go. There's a plot, children. I hope you enjoyed. 
Oh no, the spooky spirits are going to be mean to this dragon. Who would do such a cruel and horrendous thing? And then they died. They died while they were already dead and were thus condemned to go to double hell. Okay, I, I... I shot that guy, you all saw it, right? Like, it was right in front of you all. Not appreciate how hard those all guys are to kill. Nice to learn ya. Get back here. Turn around. Walk away. That should have killed you. There's a lot of gems. Uh, why is everything on fire all the time? Give me that. Look, just because I'm hunting for the treasure my old man was looking for does not mean I'm going to pass up all the other stuff we find en route. Like this. It's the least efficient way I can go about this. That's what I was asking myself this morning. The crystals themselves were made of solid gold. I see, it kind of seems to defeat the point. What are you doing? That dragon just decided he really didn't like that wall. I thought he was trying to shoot VR into the sides. I mean, that's what Sherlock spent his afterlife doing. You dick. No way. Could have gone very poorly, but it didn't. Once again, everything's coming up, Mitsu. Don't like the way this guy's looking at me. There. We go on the field. Excuse you. That's not our game at all. Uh. Despawned too quickly. Gotta get all my bonus items. It's an arcade style game, that's the only reason to do anything. That was the wrong one, dang it. Speaking of points, guess who doesn't have any anymore? I don't like the way these dragons are looking at me either. Alright, you little bitch. Come here, come here. Oh, it's me, the blob. It's you, Nia, the blob. Thank you for killing me. I will definitely not hold revenge in my heart for the rest of my life. Collect them in the sparkly order. Collect them in the sparkly order. That's the fundamental rule of the game. Get all these out of the way now. Turn around and walk away. Joik. That guy on ice. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, a gold wand. I still do not know what I did to earn it. But I have it now. So many dragons in this place. <sighs> that... That minor little issue with the... Only being able to have so many projectiles on screen at once is proving to be a bit of an issue. Alright, what got me that gold wand? I would like to know very badly, please and thank you. Okay, yeah, I guess it is just doing a loop around the place. Give. Shoot the dragon in the back. Shoot the dragon in the back again. Can I get another one? I'd like another one, please and thank you. Doesn't look it. Maybe if I go around that way. I wanna get my rank up. Please and thank you. Stop yelling at me. I know what I'm doing. Why did you just stop? Who gave you permission to walk away from me? But hey, at least we got the bell. God, would you look at all this stuff? L O D S O F E M O N E. What's that spell? I didn't know that was temporary. How many points can I get? I was out of the tomato. Don't worry, there's an identical tomato right next to it. Night guy. I believe his gimmick listed in the manual was that he had a shield that would stop you from shooting him anywhere other than in the back or sides. Or in other words, not in the front. Other way. Second one's all the way up there. Turn around, turn around, there's a human skull on the ground, turn around, turn around. Yeah. Regression is strange, why are knights more dangerous than dragons? I mean, when was the last time you heard a story in which... I don't have a key. I mean, knights kill dragons all the time, but not the other way around. I want my key, I want my key, please and thank you, you can't get key. He's on the same stage where you get. Can't get keys on the same stage where you get chests. Them's the rules. Where even is anything anymore? Nights need backup. I mean, I don't know what sort of stories you've been reading. Get back here! That ought to learn ya. Yeah, that chest is just mocking me at this point. There. And then we left. Look at all those points. Look at this, this fellas, they're all so happy. You should always respect some of your friends' personal space. 
Especially if they have no qualms against beating the shit out of you. Boink. Boink. I went the wrong way again. The team demands a lot of focus from you and offers not a lot in return for it. I'll teach you. Right, would appreciate a one-up again, thank you. Thank you. Back in Bleezness. Yoink. Boink. And hear me out. A yoink. Why didn't that kill you? Oh my gosh, that skeleton! How spooky! Alright, whatever, I'm leaving. Alright, I'm going, I'm going! Don't rush me! And nag? Do skeletons die if you shoot them? Survey says yes. Who's next over here? Ooh. Good doctrine believe why skeletons stronger than knights were stronger than dragons. Because skeletons don't die if you stab them. Because they have no organs. Please. I appreciate you spending time over there. Not at all. That was a complete waste of time for everyone involved. Doesn't necessarily make them stronger though. This is an arcade game. How hard is it to kill is literally the only metric of difficulty they have. Come on. I just shot you in the face. That's supposed to make you go away from me. A uh, little on fact that argument also applies in real life. There. I do anything for you? Mega death. Oh, you're walking into my bullets, you wanker. And then we left. Just keep on climbing up those stairs. Thought those knights had shields, but I appear to be mistaken. Who's next? You're next. I mean, these knights can shoot at us at least, which does make them a bit less scary than dragons. And also historically inaccurate because knights are famous for their use of the English longbow. Shooting tax. Idiot. <laughs> to convince a knight to turn his back on his mission so easily. Who would have believed it? Anyway, ring a bell? Is this a ring a bell? 
try any of you. Let's go around real quick like. Ding a ding a ding a ding a ding ding a 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 
behold the wizard. Beware his power. A wizard in a robe, if you will. Okay, I see how it is. It... Joink. Yoink. How am I supposed to leave this full oh. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Frame of um, little Weezon sort of recoiling like that would make a good um reaction image or channel emote or something. Spooks be gone! Dang it. You idiot. Oh, guess we're leaving now. Somehow I got the gold rod. I'm not gonna look a gift rod in the mouth. Not on stream anyway, I think that's against TLS. Aha, you fool. You fell for the classic blunder. Looks like this one is just a matter of killing enough enemies. Truly, this will be the key to our final victory. Anyone else? Come on. with blue anime. It's elementary chemistry, my dear Watson. That was our last life. Nah, there's a there's a zeroth life. This is still an NES game. Div. Thank you. Dear God, they're dying by the hundreds. Oh, the humanity. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, go in, go in. Thank you. These enemies are predictable because they... The way they work is they pick one wall and just kind of stick to it, hug it, the way you're supposed to solve a maze. But that doesn't mean they aren't obnoxious. Ah, you fool. You fell for the classic blunder. There, problem solved.
And that skeleton was barely even there. Yoink. Alright, if you want to just stand there and take it, I'm not going to stop you. Oh, we got two, do two gold wands, but that's good enough for me. Much like I see is for Cookie, that is also good enough for me. Oh dear. Alright, so wand shots block... I was saying, one shot block a dragon fire, but not. Wizard spells of some make or model. Now we know. And knowing is half the battle. Ah, you fool. When do I- Oh, you five alarm crotch weasel. No, 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 no. Are beginning to annoy me, good sir. Oh, come on. This guy is mathematically the absolute worst. There, be gone. Ah, uh, just go for score, just go for score. Stage ain't gonna be here forever. No one lives forever. Bonk. Bloop. Go around up top. Wow, you really showed me. Can I maybe convince one of you to get out of the way, please and thank you? There we go. Alright. Let's turn up the heat. In the land of the blue, the red-staffed man is king. Sorry, I don't believe I could convince- don't suppose I could convince you to get up and walk into my fire, could you? In general. Okay, we did it. In the end, isn't that really all that matters? Because look, there's more spooky spirits. Nobody cares about your goddamn end of the world prophecies, old man. You've been chanting these since 2012. I forget Ultimate Revenge by burning the Ice Mage alive there. Nah, nah, I just, I just had to leave. All I really wanted at that point was to disentangle myself from that whole scenario. Didn't mean to kill that guy, but I'm glad it happened. A lot of dead angles I do not appreciate having to work around. Speaking of dead angles. Man, imagine boiling alive in a suit of full plate. That would be awful. The crystal ball wouldn't be very efficient, everything would be tinted red. What if color coding can't be important? Bonk. Don't you try and jump me. Go the other way. Turn your back on me and all of the issues I ever present in society. We are out of there. Alright, you're down here now. 
I see how it is. Now the blue one. And there's a purple dragon. Uh, you're bad and you should feel bad. Nope. I see how it is. Shape him and he hit me while he was in the process of taking damage. I see how it is. Well, there's the two hour mark. Guess that's as good a drop me off place as anyway. That was a pretty decent run. Tomorrow we will be playing our next episode of Ace Attorney Fan Game Showcase with the next part of. I, I forgot the title for the sack for a second. A turnabout with too many faces. Beginning of day two. What will lie? This time will be 5 p.m. I, I think that's what I wrote. I honestly don't remember. But whatever the case is, hope you all enjoy. Enjoying that game quite a bit, actually. And until then, th thank you all for coming, and I will see all of you in the next episode. Goodbye. Try not to die.